Hey there, guys, and hey there, sheepdoggers. Bah, fucking balls. Hey, what's up, guys? And welcome to the city of brass. I fucked up my intro. <sighs> Alright. Welcome to the first tutorial of gameplay. Uh, until the one. Yep, yeah, one's barely, barely visible. That sounds good. Uh, first look tutorial and gameplay for City of Brass. It's a roguelike type uh, game. And we're gonna check it out. Okay, that's move. I have moved. Uh, so you see the Twitch thing on the right. Actually, uh, we should probably turn that off. Uh, how do we turn it off? Yeah, we'll turn it off for now. Uh, so that that's not in the way while we're playing. I haven't played this on Twitch yet. Cool. I, I haven't played this on Twitch yet, so um, I'm gonna check it out probably in a bit, which means that it'll be it'll be done. You know, the the stream will probably be done by the time you see this video. Okay, let's check out the game and see how it, how it goes. Open. All right. What are you? Oh God. Welcome, O Traveller, to these streets of brass and death. Enter and find that which will be your curse, as it was our curse, and remain still. Okay, cool. Lovely. Let's see what we got here. Wow, it's reasonably loud. Okay. Space to jump. What do you have to say for yourself? Behold, we built this city here a thousand years, and amassed treasures from all quarters of the earth as a jewel in the desert. The brass towers of the city shone with wealth and our pride. Okay. To climb. Go. But when all are rich beyond imagining, who would be a servant? And so in, I'm gonna turn the sound down very slightly again to like here, I guess. There you go. Uh. Who would be a servant, and so, in our power and recklessness, our rulers bound the diabolical genies into servitude. Well, also spelt D-J-I-N-N, -N, or something like that. Run, ju run, jump, and hold space to cross world wide gaps. So, I assume run is, is shift? No. What's, what's run? I guess you just run naturally. Uh, as you as you walk, you run. Maybe? What's this? Nothing. Okay. Control to duck beneath. Okay. In their thirst for ultimate power, the rulers made a final terrible pact, imprisoning a trio of genies at the center of the city. They're guaranteed that the city would become immortal. Sweet. Run and crouch to slide for a speed boost. I think that worked? Did I miss anything? I don't think so. Okay. Press E to pick up treasure. Ooh, money. Money, money, money. But a city filled with dread magics was no jewel. Rather, it was a beacon of warning. Our allies fled and ref ref refused to return. Our trade dried up, and one cannot eat gold. We began to starve. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> Sorry. Sorry. That's yeah. Oh no. Guys, uh, if the devs watch this, you have to be able to whip out candles, guys. That's just that's just something that's, that's gotta happen. Follow the arrow to the exit. I mean, I'll talk to this guy. Nah! Woo! Sweet. Madness reigned. Power and magic twist the mind. We filled our city with rock and rock. With traps to protect our wealth. Against whom... We knew not, for who would visit such a bedeviled place? Sup, brah. It'll be me. Ah. 
Hit them in the head with the whip to stun them. Down you go. Interesting that they're like, hmm. As the curse took deeper hold, lo, we turned on each other like rabid dogs. But those in the city can never truly die. The streets became filled only with the undead. Okay, what a shove as well. Didn't realize that was a trap. Oh, cool. We probably don't want to stand on that, though. Oh, you can activate traps with the whip, too. Sweet. So this is very whip-based, I'm feeling like. Gather treasure to increase your score. In time, the city sank beneath the sands, waiting for someone to break the curse. But only fools come, intent on taking riches for themselves. No one, none ever leave. All become cursed. Well, this doesn't look good for me. Okay, I can kind of dodge as well. Hiya! And you, fool, will you learn from our folly? Will you be the one to free us from our torment? Will you free yourself? Wait, we're in torment? Okay. Okay, that's kind of cool. Okay, so we've done the tutorial. Um, that's kind of cool. That's, this seems kind of fun. So, starting loadout, uh, leaderboards, burdens and blessings. Proficient blessing. A divine blessings and burden allow you to make the game easier or harder, depending on the challenge you are after. Ooh. So, we could take, like, the proficient blessing, increase player health, fewer enemies, decrease number of traps, uh, increase drop of rarer items. Oh, let's do that. Uh, reduce all genie costs, remove time limit. Let's do that. Uh, decrease enemy attack rate. So we'll have most things going. Uh, you, that's so cool that you actually have to um, you have to do certain things to unlock the harder the harder crap. Where it's just like, yeah, no, you, you suck. You, you need to uh, global high score. Dragon bra, hey dragon bra. Um, Although, in my experience with games like Isaac and, and things like that, where, you know, you've got, like, a, a leaderboard and things, there, there are some people who always uh, cheat and, and fuck the system. Uh, playing with Divine Blessings will disable some leaderboards. Sure. Sure. We're going to give this game a little bit of a looky-loo. The Abandoned Outskirts. So, I'm wondering exactly how this will go in terms of roguelike. Okay. Okay, Brazier. Uh, once decorative source of light comfort, now no more than a fragile vessel of fire. You've encountered Brazier one times. Hiya! So here's the entrance. We turn the time off so we can just, uh, just kind of check things out as we go. Right. Oh god! Artifice of Impalement. Concealed in the ground, skewers of iron and brass spring upwards. The trap, Artifice of Impalement, has killed you no times, dealing a total of two damage to you. Yes, thank you. City, Outer Ring, City of Brass. Uh, gear, Fool's Blade. Uh, Fool's Cloth. Fool's Whip. Okay. Bring it! Got him! Okay, cool. So let's get more muns, hung. 
will be wanting to grab some stuff here. Uh, oh, what's this? Oh, a crap ton of money. Nice. And up here. This is kind of cool little, like... Oh, God. Okay. Why are you back up? I also got a J for what is this? Around here somewhere. No? Okay. Alright. Well, never mind. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, goddamn traps! Oh! Awesome! Okay. No, no! Ow, god damn it! Uh, Ab Abyssal the Trafficker. This kind of looks like it should be VR, in a way. Light of the following... Cudgel of Refutation... Oh, nice! Gauntlet of Hurling, let's not get that. What's Wish? Wish. What is this? Uh, Cudgel of Refutation. The, this club will send your enemies flying, even as it, as it damages them. Okay, Light of Following. This charm flame will light your way. Ooh. I really, uh, Abzul the Trafficker. Abzul's stocks change on whim, but he's always open for trade for a price. A wish will reveal Abzul's most rare, I rare items. You have used him a few times. So what the hell does a wish do? Because I really need a wish right now. Uh, one might think it foolish to store explosive liquids in such a fragile vessel. One would be correct. You have encountered the cask of volatility one times. Okay. Uh... A curse guardian, servant, I did receive damage from that, tortured soul, uh, tortured soul has killed you, uh, did something affect these creatures even before the city fell? Okay, so what's the thong of, thong of vines, let's find oh we got you whip, we got you whip guys, Jay, uh, devious magic summons tangling creepers to slow your enemy's approach, okay. Oh god! Oh god! I'm so almost dead already. Tangling vines! Tangling vines! Oh lord. There we go. Get wrecked, bitches! Tangling vines are all mine! Oh. Oh, poopsies. I didn't even get to the bosses and stuff. Oh, okay. Well, I died. It's fine. It's absolutely fine. No problem, we're just going to try again. Yeah, it's night time this time. Okay. So we got four hearts. I saw other things. Is there. Mm. Ah! Let's have a look around here. We have uh, some muns. Oh, there's different ways to go. Is there a map? There doesn't seem to be a map. 
we'll, we'll double double check, but uh, that doesn't seem to have happened so far. And I like the fact that there are traps in this. It kind of like if if they add in a whole load of like different traps and things, it could be really interesting. Hey, buddy. Okay. So, hey, summon companion. Ooh, we need to get some money for that. Is this back in... Okay, that's back in there. So this is the, the same kind of place. Can't get up there. Got sand falling down. Is that a trap? No, it's just sand falling down. Okay, cool. I'm, I'm, I'm going to be honest. So far... I, so far, I kind of like the look of this. What's up, buddy? Oh, shit! There we are. Okay. Any traps around here? Nope, don't, probably don't want to press E on that. That looks like it was going to explode. Uh, difficult to see, Joe. Okay, hello. I see you. Oh, God, what? Absol the Trafficker. Talisman of Confusion, Gaunt of Hurling, Blade of Cleaving. Wish as well. Let's wish. Charm of vitality. Ooh. Heels of rising. Strip of igni ignition. I spent money on my freaking. Okay. Let's just ignore that. Let's keep fighting and look for some more mums, shall we, for now? Is there anything up here? The traps seem to be a thing getting me all the time. Oh, there's one. Oh, God. Ha-ha! <laughs> Suck it! Oh, God. Fire, 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 fire! Okay, they stay on fire and it hurts you. Good to know. There's a trap. Yeah! Okay, get a bit more money. Because over this way, we have that dude who we want to go and see. Because he had something cool. Oh, God. Yep, yep. No, remember that now. Ah, we're almost... We're halfway dead again. Summon companion. Hey, buddy. Dad. Dad. Dosu the cell sword. Uh, may not be able to protect you, protect you directly, but he'll summon a guard to follow. A wish will make a more robust escort. Oh, okay. And traps. Yes, we found the bre breath of disintegration. That's always lovely. Beacon of combustion. Vas va vase of entropy. Uh, vessel of volatility. And we've got a friend. Hey, buddy! <laughs> Go over there. Yeah, we've got a, got a friend to help us out. Just remember where the traps are and stuff, dude. We may want to save money for a heal or, or something as well. In the future. Okay, so there's enemies around here. Oh, up, up. Okay. Is that a door there? Okay. Ah! I sla- I snapped the, uh, I snapped the knight. Oh god! It's alright. It's okay. Funny. I snap, I snap the knight out of the sand. Get more money. No, I want that though. I want that. Where is he? I didn't mean to set you on fire. Don't chase me. Pro tip: Don't you set your friends on fire. Uh, it's not good for the for the friendship. I found. Okay. <laughs> Oh, 
Okay, he's not affected by the stun, apparently. Uh, give health. Yeah. What is that? J. The Betun the Curative. Some might say Betun services are too costly, but what worth has a life? And why not expend a wish to increase the vitality boon Betun provides? Okay, I wonder how wishes work. I still haven't figured that out. Okay. Oh, we've got a door here. Okay. I'm so, I'm so lost, incidentally. I'm so lost. Come on, buddy. Come on, buddy. Oh, thank you. Hell yeah. Boom. Suck it. Game. Game. Possibly. I should. I should probably have looked longer. Maybe. I. I. I don't understand what the wishes do. Um. 150 loot. Really? Do I still, okay, I still have my body. So, so far, this is seeming fairly uh, roguelike, which is good. Oh, Lord. This is not good. Do not have enough of that, Beaton. Oh, Beaton, yeah. Uh. Okay. So far, I hear a chicken. No! Give me the chicken! What the hell is this? Somehow dragged in the city's curse, this bird creates a distracting spectacle when thrown. Okay, so they get distracted by the chicken? That's... That's... Oh, God! What a seven day series of this because uh, I'm, I'm very much down for for a seven day series of this it's it's see it's I'm not sure it has the length or uh, or kind of like synergy and and etc of things like uh, the binding of Isaac it seems like kind of a fun game I quite like it um, it's got a really nice aesthetic like this whole kind of uh, Middle Eastern vibe going on you know kind of Arabian Nights and things like that <laughs> Hey, buddy. I can't afford any, any of this stuff, man. I guess I could come back to it, though. We won't wish. I'm, I'm imagining that wishing makes, makes it harder. So you get better items, but... So far, um... Of spikes, okay. So, so far, one thing I have found. So far, one thing I have found about this game is that the, um. Nice. Uh, I've, I've found that this game is uh, the combat, as in the melee weapon, or at least the starting melee weapon, isn't great. Like, it's very slow. 
That may change as you get other weapons, but uh, so far that's quite what I've found. So let's have a look. Uh, let's be careful about that. Let's take the Bloom of Frost. So what's this? Uh, for every strike your body takes, a freezing blast shall be returned. That's really cool. Let's take the Cudgel of Refutation. I like this thing. It, it worked well last, last time. Oh, the Fool's Cloth. Oh, free. Okay. What's that? Uh, the Fool's Cloth. Equipped. Uh, rags of Mildly Uncommon of Thief. Okay. Oh, no. I wanted the... Oh. Oops. I'll take the Bloom of, of Thing back. So, Talisman of Confusion. Let's see what that is. Uh, gain a precious extra moment before your enemies see you for who you are. Oh, nice. So, okay, cool. So, so we're not going to wish. Yeah, we're not going to wish. So it looks like you have a weapon, you have a whip. Face of entropy. Oh, sweet! That's so cool. So I can, uh, I can, I can grab items to use like, yeah. like this, just by pressing Q, and it will come into my hand. That's kind of cool. <laughs> suck it. Also suck it. Ow! Oh, oh god, damn that frost! Is fun. Uh, that explosion! That's fun. Ow! Ow! I don't know what that was. Damn it. Okay. Good news. Just, uh, just walking into things isn't gonna screw you over. Give me that. Go, got him. Get more monies in. Nothing in there. Okay, looking good. Looking good. Uh, hey, buddy. Disable traps. Ooh. I don't know what the wish could do. Can we? No, can't get up there. So we need to hire jump to get up there. Interesting. Yeah. Didn't even slightly need to do that. And apparently, that threw fire everywhere. <laughs> Looks like there's a little bit of a tinkle, uh, like visually. <gasps> yeah, I know, buddy, but. Oh, I do have enough of that. B Town the Curative. Let's, uh, let's get healed. Although, we. Oh, God. We did get a. Uh, <laughs> We we did get a uh, like a weird kind of devil fork going on. Oh lord! God damn fire! There we go. So it looked like there might be a bit of tinkle, a twinkle in uh Interesting. Hey buddy. Oh he was holding on to it so I couldn't grab it. That's so cool. Okay, so, um, there are certain things that are kind of interesting, I'll say. Gauntlet of Hurling, Strap of Impact. Right, this. Let's see what this is. Uh, we're in to lash a weights that knock back even the stoutest of foes. Okay, that's kind of cool. Uh, and let's try the Gauntlet of Thrusting as well. So what's that? 
Forceful kick of a stubborn mule now powers your shoves. I can't remember how to shove. But, okay. Alright. Where do we go? Uh, oh, I did not see that there. Yeah! Oh, and then we can do... Okay, that's... Alright, I need to find a door now, though. Oh, there's a door right there, you freaking idiot. But... God damn it! Freaking explosions! There we go. I think we got them all there. Just gotta look out for stuff. I'm not good at looking out for stuff in this bloody game. Uh, what do we got here? 375. Okay, there we are. <coughs> Takes a bit of a while to get through as well, doesn't it? Ah! Okay. Got him! They put that there just so you could do that whip thing, regardless of like if there are any whip places or anything. You're just like, ha ha. Um, I like this game. It's kind of fun. Yeah, it was literally just like I was uh, I was looking through Steam, just just randomly. I, I wasn't even looking for anything particularly, uh, and I saw this game and I was like, oh, it says roguelike. Um, you know, maybe it will maybe, maybe it'll have a few interesting things. I don't know, have Bloom of Frost. Lash of Reach. Okay, what's the Lash of Reach do? A cunning weave extends the painful influence of your lash. Does that mean that it reaches further? No! Hmm, cheatsy bastards. Let's try the Blade of Cleaving. So, what's this? Hefty blade increases your reach. So now we've gone from pushback to reach, which is kind of fun. Okay, cool. What we got in here? Oh, what, what do we have in here? I think we got a weapon. Did we get a weapon? Cudgel, gauntlet, rash, lash. We got the cudgel of refutation, apparently. I think, uh... Did I not see? Yeah, okay. And, and that one. Hello. Okay. I think, I think that's everything. Oh, God. Yeah. No, there's Cudgel of Ref Refutation. So I've still got the cudgel, cudgel of Ref Refutation? You know what? Screw it. Okay, let's see what the wish is. Uh, Abzul Stocker. Don't that's not wish. What's wish? <laughs> Uh, genies, no. Uh, let's see if it's in here. Journal. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, equipped enemies, traps, gear, items of city. No. What? What do wishes do? Screw it. We'll wish. Body of thorns. Oh, I want that. Vessel of vigor. I probably want that actually. So, what's this do? Vessel of vigor. The vessel captures life force of your fallen enemies and provides healing when full. Fuck yeah, we want that. Actually, fuck yeah, I need that. Oh, my, my weapon's there, okay. So I'm just gonna check. Okay, I can see the vessel down there. So I'll pick up the, the sword. Wow, this weapon's slow, okay. But strong. What? Who are you? Ah! Okay. Killed by Etol the Hurler. Okay, so we're not going to do another one. I'll, I'll, I'm going to end this video here because I, you know, uh, I don't want to go too deep into it. I want to. 
I want to do a live stream on this. Uh, with, during the live stream, people can mess with you and help you and, and things like that as well. But I just want to see who the hell is Etol channeling dark magics. Etol casts for fireballs to scorch and slaughter. But with a wish, those same fireballs will turn upon your enemies. Oh, so he sounds a bit more like a trap, maybe. And you can go up and wish on him and okay. Uh, so there you go, guys. That is uh, City of Brass, which is actually... It's in early access, so I assume that they're going to add more stuff as time goes on. But uh, I, I just saw it, and I was like, this looks kind of fun. Let's try it. So there you go. So thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps out a lot, and of course, I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one.